WSLS was the first TV station in the Roanoke Valley, and we have crews installing the very first color TV cameras in our studio. That was back in 1967. We have come a long way since then, and it's only getting better. Today, the station took another step forward as we broke ground on a brand new station in Roanoke. Well, Emily, are you as excited as I am? I am really excited, John. I, I, from the first time I walked into the old building, which, let's be honest, it's kind of past its useful life, I was looking and hoping that we could do this for you. And so to get started and dig up the first mound of dirt, it's really exciting. Emily Barr, CEO of WSLS parent company Graham Media, said it all. It's time for a new TV station. Well, John, we're hoping to start next week. We're waiting on the building permit, but the city of Roanoke's been great to work with. So hopefully, fingers crossed, we're going to be here starting next week. Well, as you can see, it's just a big, empty shell of a building right now. But by March, this is going to be a state-of-the-art television station. Are we putting windows in? Isn't that a big part of it? Oh, yes. Windows, windows. Did I say windows? Windows wherever we can put them. That is necessity. And there will be modern upgrades that move the station's footprint beyond just broadcasting. So we are not just a television station anymore. We are a media center that ha that is serving television, digital, mobile, all kinds of things. We're going to be coming up uh, here on the assignment day desk. The planning has been in the works for months. Back probably looking at the plans here, almost to that, that, that support beam right there. Um, we're going to have 50% more square footage in our new studio than we have in our current studio. Tink! There we go, a new building. 